Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Melissa Stevens. And I'm Terry McFadden. Notre Dame's Campus Art Museum of the last 43 years has closed its doors to the public. But in this case, when one door closes, another stands poised to open. Mark Peterson joins us live in the studio with more Mark. Oh, sets of doors, whatever. It's the end of an era. The Snipe Museum of Art has closed to the public. But a new campus museum will open this weekend, a $66 million project named for its donors, the Racklin Murphy Museum of Art. Just a step or two inside the front door, Notre Dame's new museum has a wow factor in the form of a three-story atrium and a name drop. The entire atrium floor is a work of art. We commissioned Maya Lin, who did the Vietnam War Memorial, to do the uh, portrait, so to speak, of the St. Joseph River. So, you know, we have this tremendous uh, uh, Mesoamerican collection. There are 23 galleries in all, more than 1,000 works on display, works that date back as far as 4,000 years, works that are finally in the right place at the right time. The fact that Notre Dame has had an art museum has always had a uh, community pulse. But in recent years, as the campus has grown and as parking became more complicated, it became more and more difficult to access us. So we've never had the luxury of um, a space to celebrate Central and South America. And so for the first time, this whole space is celebrating Central and South America. The new museum is on the southern edge of campus, just north of the intersection of Eddie and Angela, which should make it easier to access for everyone, including the 11,000 school children who visit here each year. Also, the new museum will carry on the same tradition as the old. I think one of the greatest things in the world to say is that we're free and we're open to all. You know, if you look at major municipal museums across the country, their ticket price is $20 now, going up to $30, and that's a lot. So the role of the visual is so important for today's society, but also for jumping in a little bit more deeply, the opportunity to connect with the past to understand the present day, but also to begin to consider the future. Those are all things that a good, high-quality art museum can offer you, and we certainly have that. The museum will open Friday night at 6 with a DJ and a cash bar. A family-friendly fair takes place Saturday and Sunday, drumming, dancing, singing, and, of course, Shakespearean monologues.